What are people talking about on social media today? Hashtag LeBron. Will LeBron losing in the NBA Finals actually help his legacy? That's the debate today on social media. Hello, I'm Jenna Cederberg, and this is the 406. And now, here are the top statewide headlines at this hour. A federal judge is pressing U.S. officials to explain why it's taken three decades to decide on a proposal to drill for natural gas just outside Glacier National Park in an area considered sacred by some Indian tribes in Montana and Canada. A frustrated U.S. District Judge Richard Leon called the delay troubling and a nightmare during a recent court hearing. After two Yellowstone River oil pipeline breaks in five years, U.S. Senator Steve Daines is requesting an oversight hearing on the Pipeline and Hazardous Materials Safety Administration. The agency has been the nation's pipeline cop for a decade and is up for reauth reauthorization by September's end. As part of the Department of Transportation, the administration has overseen two Montana pipeline disasters that together dumped at least 93,000 gallons of oil into the Yellowstone. There have been more grizzly bear sightings southeast of Red Lodge this spring than in, any, in, than in decades. Along the eastern face of the Beartooth Mountains, there may be close to about 24 individual bears, most of them southeast of Red Lodge, said Sean Stewart, a wildlife biologist with Fish, Wildlife, and Parks in Red Lodge. The woman who resigned as president of the Spokane NAACP after her parents in northwestern Montana revealed she was white, posing as black, says there's no proof they are her mother and father. Rachel Dolezal said she hasn't had a DNA test and there's no biological proof that Larry and Ruth Ann Dolezal of Troy are her parents. Directors at six state agencies say they'll be ready to record their meetings when new transparency laws requiring them to do so take effect this year. Five agency boards must make video or audio, audio recording of their meetings available online or on television within one working day beginning July 1st. That's it for the 406. Subscribe to our The 406 Video YouTube channel and tell us your thoughts about the show in a comment. Have a great evening.